So you say you want to make money with cryptocurrency through Coinbase? Well, guess what? This video is for you. Hey guys, this is Jesse with Keeping It Real Finance, a channel that always has your back and tells it like it is. In today's video, we are going to be talking about exactly that subject, how to make money with Coinbase. So really, we're going to be digging into the math. We are going to be contrasting and comparing the different coins that are out there to try to identify the best opportunities for you moving forward so that you can get into crypto, or if you're already in crypto, you can make money moving ahead, right? So as always, if you're a first time viewer, make sure to hit the subscribe button, click the bell to turn on notifications, and if you enjoy today's content, please, please, please make sure to click that like button. I would greatly appreciate it, and it'd be a fantastic Christmas present for the channel. So thanks again. <laughs> All right, now let's get it going. So today's video is going to be a little bit different from my other videos in the sense that I'm not going to break down a big outline or anything like that. But what I am going to do is show you an Excel chart that I have created based on the 42 coins that you can currently buy or sell on Coinbase. Okay, so let's get the chart up. All right. Now the first thing here in the chart is that we have all 42 of the coins that are currently available on Coinbase. So uh, one thing that's kind of interesting with Coinbase is that there are additional coins out there and you can look at them, but you can't necessarily buy or sell them on there, okay? So what I'm looking at specifically are these ones that I can buy or sell. Now, if you're looking at the chart with me, uh, what I've done is I've taken all of them in there, I put in the one year gain percentage as well as the all time gain percentage. I put in uh, roughly the start year that shows up on Coinbase. Now this may not be the actual start year for this particular coin, but this is the year that shows on Coinbase, uh, as well as today's price. Now today is December 23rd, 2020. This is what the price is right now. This is a constantly moving target and this, these prices will be outdated by tomorrow. Uh, but the main thing you need to know is the gain percentages, okay? So, I have also color-coded this chart. So if you look at the chart here, uh, anything in red is theoretically an investment you don't want. Anything in yellow is something that, eh, maybe you want to look into it. The things in light green are pretty good, and the things in dark green are really good, all right? So I went ahead and I've sorted it by the all-time gains. So this is somewhat surprising, but you can see here based on the chart that the all-time top gainer actually isn't Bitcoin, believe it or not, it is Dash. <laughs> I, I didn't know that. I, you know, these are the things that you learn when you start comparing these. And if you saw my video from yesterday, this was one of my complaints with Robinhood, is that I would like to be able to compare and contrast various uh, stocks or coins all together. I can't do this on Coinbase either, uh, so I had to create an Excel sheet for this, okay? Uh, now, outside of that, with Dash, uh, their all-time gain percentage is over 45,000%. Boy, I wish I had gotten into that one in 2014, okay? Uh, some of the other top ones up here, Bitcoin, Ethereum. Here's a new one, this AAVE. 14,749%, and this one just started in 2020. So could there be more upside for that one? Yeah, absolutely, why not, right? Uh, some of the other ones in here, Ethereum Classic, Chainlink, we've got XRP, Stellar Lumens, Litecoin. Uh, and if you notice here on the chart, I've highlighted the years of some of the oldest ones. So these are the ones who have been here the longest. This is Dash, Bitcoin, Ethereum, XRP, Stellar Lumens, and Litecoin. Um, as I mentioned in other videos as well, the four that you need to be aware of that PayPal will be trading in is Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and Bitcoin Cash. But if you look at the chart here, Bitcoin Cash is actually in the red. <laughs> and the funny thing is I actually own some Bitcoin Cash. Uh, so it's ironic seeing it like this in this lens that, yeah, maybe I probably shouldn't have bought that Bitcoin Cash. But at the time, I was strictly thinking about PayPal, all right? Um, so, and, you know, it's, it's up 52% on the year. That's decent, I guess. But if you look at some of the other red ones, uh, Civic, Kyber Network, and Bancor Network, 
They, they've actually come on strong as of late for this year, but overall they are still in the negatives. So I don't know if I would advise looking into those, all right? Now, if you look at some of these other top ones here, um, you know, an example, Maker. So look at this one, overall 22,000, or sorry, 2,248%. It, it started four years ago in 2017. And roughly this year though, only 12%. So that's, that's not as good as it could be, right? Uh, you know, another one here, Synthetic Network. So that one's even better. Uh, this Yearn Finance is, looks to be fantastic, uh, 2020, and it's up 2,076%. But today's price is 22,725. So what I wanted to show here in the chart is something else that you need to be aware of or the, the today's prices. So if you look at the ones that are dark green, well, what are today's prices? If you look at those, uh, you know, the cheapest one on this list would be Stellar Lumens at uh, roughly 14%. You've also got um, XRP at 32, uh, sorry, 32 cents and 14 cents. Um, some other cheap ones on here. Here's one at, uh, what's this, 572 Band Protocol 2019. That's pretty good. Uh, $8.02, $8 uh, Synthetic Network. Uh, so what I'm showing you here and what I'm trying to highlight is, first of all, the, the staple coins, the big dogs, are Dash, Bitcoin, Ethereum, uh, you know, you could argue this AAEV or the, the, the AAVE, excuse me, is a is one of the big dogs. Uh, you know, the Ethereum Classic overall, it's it's fantastic, but as of this year, it's kind of mediocre. So I don't know if I would jump into that one right away. Uh, Chainlink looks pretty good. Uh, so you can see sort of the big dogs, but then you can also see some upcoming uh, maybe stars. Some of these 2020 ones. Look at UMA. 487%. So that's pretty good also. You know, you think about a stock investment, and if you put this money in a stock and it went up 100%, that would be a fantastic investment. Some of these, though, at the top of this list, 45,000% for Dash. OMG. That's instant millionaire status if you get into that low enough. And so I think what you need to do is identify the stock, or excuse me, not the stocks, the coins that are performing well, and if those are ones that you want to get into. Uh, one of the interesting things with Coinbase is when you look into these different coins, uh, they, they have very odd descriptions, and I think the normal person can't follow any of this, and honestly, I have a hard time following it as well. I think uh, what happens here with the, the crypto market is that it swings up and down, Typically, it's, it appears to be by about 10%. One day it's up 10%, the next day it's down 10%. It seems to follow the markets. So the markets were up on hopes of a stimulus, then Trump came out last night and blasted the stimulus, said no. <laughs> so now, you know, markets are down. And so uh, I don't know if coins go up or down based on the actual coin. It seems like more so as a market overall, and this could be where that high frequency trading is coming in and out. Uh, because if they're going off algorithms, if as as a whole, if it's selling, then they'll sell. As if it's buying, then they'll buy, and that could explain some of this. Okay, so uh, you know the the bottom line here with this chart is you can see the ones in red. Uh, I wouldn't advise getting into those. I don't think you're going to make any money there. Uh, the ones in yellow, yeah, you could make money, but could you do better? Yes. So if you look at the ones in the light green and the dark green, these are the ones where you have the potential to make the most money uh, in, within the crypto world. And I would argue that you would probably want to look at the ones, um, maybe, maybe take your gambles on the ones that are the smallest uh, daily prices. So if you look at those small daily prices, those are worth gambling. As I mentioned in my video on the meteoric rise of crypto, if you had bought $45 worth of Bitcoin in 2011, you would be a millionaire today. So can you afford to drop $50 in one of these? Probably. Would you miss it? Probably not. Uh, as always, we're discussing a long-term strategy. I'm not talking about day trading crypto. I'm talking about long-term. These are holds for over 10 years. This is what we're looking at today. Uh, but that being said, I think those are worthwhile gambles. 
Now, if you have large chunks of money, uh, I, would, I would highly advise if you're looking at investing in large chunks, look at these dark green ones, the Dash, the Bitcoins, the Ethereums. Uh, look at their, their yearly gain outside of just their all-time gain. So some of these yearly, uh, you know, Chainlink has been absolutely fantastic. That one's doing great. Synthetics net Network is doing great. Uh, Band Protocol is doing absolutely awesome. So some of these here you, you could absolutely get into, okay? Now, the whole point of this video is I wanted to provide you a comparison and a chart because you cannot see this on your own unless you create this, all right? So if, if you got it here on the screen, this is where you may want to pause it, take a photo of it with your phone, and then you'll have the information there and you can simply go right off of these percentages. As I mentioned, the prices will change. The percentages fluctuate a little bit, but not a lot. And so overall, anything in the green area of this chart uh, could very well make you money in the crypto world. And absolutely, it is a worthwhile investment. I have been completely naive to crypto up until just recently, and especially researching some of these videos, I realized how naive I was. So I'm trying to help you out here. If you watch this channel, this could very well, and I am not blowing smoke up your, you know what, this could very well be a way for you to become a millionaire, and I am not joking, okay? So with that, this is, that's today's video. That is my Christmas present to all of you out there who follow the channel or who uh, follow crypto and may want to get into crypto. This is sort of a beginner's lens of looking into this. Any more than that, I don't know how much further you want to get into the weeds on this stuff. As I mentioned, if you look at the descriptions on Coinbase, some of these things, I have no idea what they do. And frankly, I don't really care. Uh, what I do care about, though, are the numbers, because at the end of the day, math doesn't lie. All right? So this is Jesse with Keeping It Real. And if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to smash the like button. And I will see you next time, most likely after Christmas. So happy holidays to all, and I'll see you later.